Hey, hey guys. guys. Hey, welcome to our channel or welcome back. Thank you guys so much for clicking on this video. Guys, we're going to be mowing four yards today. Three of them very close together. One of them a little piece down the road. If you've been with us, you've seen all these yards. This is going to be nothing new. But uh, we just pulled up and I'm um, hearing a chainsaw in the background. So that's reminding me. Year, I'm guys. thinking about uh, we need to cut some firewood because... Uh, do any of you guys have um, a wood burner stove or uh, uh, is that what it's called? Yeah. You know, <laughs> in your house is that do? Yeah, like uh, I guess that's what they, you could cook on top of it, but it's not like we do have an actual oven, you know, in our kitchen. But um, we do have a big wood burning um, stove that's in our basement that we do heat our home with in the winter time. So, do any of you guys do that? Let us know in the comments. Uh, we cut a lot of wood. Yeah, so hopefully, I was thinking uh, we'll make some videos of that for you guys pretty soon because we've already, there's a couple trees on this uh, property that we've been eyeballing. So we're going to yeah. hopefully drop those pretty soon and we'll do a video. We'll cut that up. And that should be pretty fun, guys. But uh, yeah, it started out really cool this morning. I was expecting it to be pretty cool when we got down here because normally this yard is one of our pretty shady yards. Um, but right here in the sun, it's pretty warm, I'm feeling like. And then it starts sweating. But, uh... Turns out the shade moves as the day goes on. Yeah. <laughs> we're here. We're usually, like... We used to be always on the yards at, like, always kind of the same time. But here recently, we've been, like, going all at different times of the day. <laughs> so sometimes early, sometimes late. Right now, it's, uh... It's probably, it's like midday. It's like 2.30. But Harley did work at the school this morning, so, uh... We got started late, but that's okay. That's okay. Everything is meant to be. But, uh, yeah, we got to get going so we can get these yards knocked out. Because, hopefully, if we can make it you know, in time, we might be watching a scrimmage basketball game with our local elementary school tonight. So, if we can make it to that, that would be super awesome. But, if we don't, <laughs> if we don't stop talking, we definitely ain't going to make it. But, uh, <laughs> all right, guys. Come on. Let's, Let's go, go mow. <laughs>
Hey guys, real quick, uh, while I'm moving the camera around. If you guys been following along and then you recognize these views, then um, you might recognize this background, but barely. Look at the lake, guys. Uh, this is Douglas Lake, or at least it used to be. <laughs> it's going down. This is actually just a little holler right here, so uh, this ain't part of the main, um, you know, the main big lake out there. Um, but yeah, it's going down. I meant to say earlier, we are actually in fall now. We're officially in fall. And uh, yeah, this is pretty much, this is a recreational man-made lake and they do um, lower it in the winter uh, and, you know, raise it back up in the summer. But uh, in the winter time, they just drop it down back to the actual river underneath and, uh, you know, allow for overflow from the tributaries and stuff uh, for the excess. Um, water we have in the winter time and stuff um but yeah guys it's a little bit sad because honestly we had so many plans we we're gonna go on the lake so many times and we haven't been on the lake at all i think i really i'm trying to think i don't think we even have went to the lake one time except for you know like here which i am still thankful uh for this but uh actually no we did we did take the kayaks out one time uh me harley and um our son and my dad we did we put them in actually here and we did float this little this little holler a little bit. I forgot about that. Okay, so we did go to the lake one time, but uh but yeah guys, uh so I'm kinda sad about that. But yeah, we gotta mow this bank, so come on, let's go mow. Okay guys, we just finished up the first yard. 
And if you know, you know, the next yard is literally just at the top of the hill. Um, these guys are neighbors with each other. Um, but, um, Harley just reminded me as we were walking up the hill, um, guys be looking out for the next video. It's going to be the Darwin's Grip giveaway because we received them in the mail. Um, and, uh, we're going to put mine on my weed eater and we're also going to be adding, this is going to be like adding weed eater accessories video <laughs> and plus Darwin's Grip giveaway, but shout out to Joe Tool again because, uh, we got the speed feed head and we will also yep. hopefully lord willing we will be installing that onto my weed eater during that same video like as we, after we do the darwin's group or whatever but um but yeah so we have one to give away i'll put all the details you know we'll go over all the details in that video but guys i'm so thankful i'm so thankful and that they were so kind to send me one because guys uh if you've been following along this yard right here um they have there's this huge bank that we weed eat but it's probably like uh, once a month. You know, it's not very often that we do it, but uh, it's a lot, a lot of weed eating. There's several yards that we have where, you know, that Darwin script where we could really both use one, you know, because there are times where we, we are both doing a good bit of weed eating, you know, at the same time. So, yeah, I'm so thankful to them. So thankful to kind people like you, Joe, <laughs> that would send us something like that you know and once we get that thing on there you know i know that's going to save me time and you know you really don't know how much i really do appreciate it you guys are so 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 super kind like each and every one of you like i say i feel like a broken record sometimes but i hope you don't get tired of hearing me say how thankful we are for you guys because we wouldn't we wouldn't have this channel without you, you know we'd be just talking to ourselves <laughs> and, and that would be no fun that would be like a little crazy, guys. <laughs> we don't want that reputation. But, uh, yeah, we just got to the top of the driveway. So we're going to shut the gate. And then uh, pull over here to the next yard. So it's going to be a short ride. But come on. Let's, let's ride. ride. Okay guys, we just pulled in. It took us 35 seconds. <laughs> I filmed it. <laughs> yeah, it literally, cause I filmed it, so I have proof. But uh, yeah guys, this is uh, this is the first, wait, is this the first yard where I changed my pattern up? I think it is. But guys, I'm just over here thinking like, I don't know what was wrong with me. I don't know why I didn't ever do that. Cause I have not, okay, get this. I have not went back to, um, doing the same pattern on any yard since then. I've been doing, I have been making up patterns. <laughs> I've been mowing. There is one yard where I did, I had a rotation of like uh, four patterns and I finally am back around on the original, the one that I used to do all the time. But uh, I really have noticed guys, it is, I feel like it's making the grass look so much better. And I'm sorry guys, I don't know why I never did that. I'm just like, I'm, you know, I'm like a person of habit, you know, when I get in a groove or something. Okay, I'm stepping in the shade for a minute. Uh, then I, I was just convinced that for some reason that that, that was quicker. But it, it's not been any quicker. I, you know, I haven't noticed, haven't noticed it slowing me down at all <laughs> doing the different patterns. I've actually been enjoying it and I do feel like some yards were quicker in the other directions. So, thank you guys for encouraging me to start doing that. But, uh. But yeah, so one down, three to go. These first three, like I said earlier, are so close together. We knocked these out super fast. So, uh, all right, guys. Come on. Let's, <laughs> yeah, let's go right. mow. <laughs>
here we are. We're at the third yard. And uh, it's pretty warm <laughs> out here. Our falls are always still pretty warm. They're mostly just cool in the morning time and in the evening time. Yeah. Oh, well, I was trying to pull the wrong side <laughs> of the hole. <laughs> that was dumb. But yeah, pretty much at this point, a lot of the actual grass grass has really slowed down. I don't know if you can see, but it's a lot of these like little seed heads and stuff, uh, which is okay or whatever. You know, it uh, it mows. You know, like I feel like you can mow quicker when it's just that, and the grass ain't so thick. And people still don't really like the way the seed heads look, so they still yeah. want that mowed down. But uh, all right, guys, come on, let's, let's come mow. mow. Okay guys, we just finished up. And this is something I was thinking about when I was mowing up. Uh, Cause this is one of our yards that's super dry, even oh, yeah. when it's wet. It's, <laughs> yeah. it's dry. Cause you guys, uh, which I don't mow the backyard anymore. Oh. I mow the front. Um, but uh, but um, yeah guys, it's mostly dirt <laughs> in the backyard. It's so dusty. Yeah, I forgot to put my glasses on. Yeah, so it's like, whew, it's dusty even in the front yard. I mean, even, you know, you can kind of see this is one yard that, because this is like kind of on some lake bottom here. A lot of this is just kind of like slate rock ground. It doesn't grow grass very well. Um, Harley can vouch for that. He grew up right down the road from here. Yeah. And uh, he's in growing a garden down there. It was a struggle. Oh, yeah. 
every year. But my whole point was, I remember um, Harley was telling me, and I did see it in the comments. Because um, every now and then I do look at the comments, guys. Um, but, uh, yeah, one of you guys were saying that y'all couldn't um, even mow because it was... Uh, so dry. Yeah, it was so dry. I and that, that, you know, anything that could cause a spark, you know, you couldn't couldn't do and so I was thinking man you know that is so crazy we've never experienced anything like that we are truly blessed like our climate is pretty good you know we don't never get too hot we don't never get too cold we kind of stay in a pretty good medium and I'm very thankful for that but I was feeling really bad for you guys that aren't having to deal with that because I know the struggle if you miss a yard you know that's never good um because that's me, you know, that's money that was missed yep. or whatever. So that's never good. But yeah, Harley, uh, he bumped the line out of <laughs> his weed ear at the last yard. So that's why you just seen him using mine really quick on this yard. But he's going to restring this one. So um, the last little yard, if you've been following along, you already know, but the gate's too small to get in any of our mowers. So we have to weed eat the whole backyard. So this Darwin's grip has really, really helped out a lot on that yard for sure, for sure. But, uh, I need to go get one. Yeah, guys, <laughs> earlier we seen this setup, oh, this man, lawn care so setup, nice. man, and I'm telling you, like, we were like, man, I, and I should have filmed it. Um, but yeah, guys, who, um, it was like F 250 truck pulling a um, trailer with three mowers on it. What it was the Z900 uh, or 600 or something big commercial Cub Cadet Zero Turn, and then. It was like ZT. Ultima ZT5. And then, guys, they had that walk behind. A nice the one, one on the back. Get, yeah. Then they had uh, two uh, push mowers. They had so oh, so that. many blowers, well, weed eaters. Guys, they were legit. And they were looking really cool, too. But uh, I should have got a, got some footage of them. We ended up seeing them again later on, too. <laughs> um, they were heading, you know, heading to, go heading to another yard. But uh, if I see them again, I'm going to get footage of them. Because uh, they, they looked really cool. But, uh, yeah, guys, he's going to pop this into place. And uh going to head on down the road to the last yard. So, all right, all guys. Right, guys. <laughs> Let's ride. Let's ride. All right, guys. Here we are. We're here. <laughs> and, uh, which if you've been following along, you already know. But if you're new, then we have to park down the, you know, a couple houses down the road from this yard. And drive the mower down there to it. Because the yard is too tiny. The yard's too tiny for the truck and the trailer. And the gate is too tiny for the mower. The neighbor right there looks like they're having a party. There's lots of people at their house right now. <laughs> There's an actually fun fact. We um, actually mowed that yard before, and the one we actually have mowed all of the houses down through here on the way to the yard that we're going to one time. Not um, not like regularly, but there was a couple times a couple years ago where they, uh, I don't know, you know, there was they needed somebody. The yard had got overgrown a few times, so they they let us mow it down a couple times. They're super super nice people, but uh, yeah, if you've been following along, then you know that. I really used to mow this, and I used to weed eat the back, but we've actually switched. So now I'm going to mow. This will be the second time that I've mowed here, which this yard is so tiny. Like, it's, uh, you know, it's... Out of your way. <laughs> yeah. I should have pulled mine on the back earlier then. should have thought of that. Never, never thinking about that, guys, <laughs> which I'm not used to. Like I said, this is going to be only the second time that I've mowed this. So I'm, uh, I'm used to just my, needing mine in the front. But, uh, all right, guys, come on.
Let's, Let's go, go mow. <laughs> Actually, um, I think we are gonna make the scrimmage game, so that's that's great. Um, we'll let you guys know how it turns out, but um, yeah, to, tomorrow's video, look out for that. It's gonna be the Darwin's Grip giveaway. So any of you guys that might have to be watching this video right now, if you're in present time, then guys, get on over to that video tomorrow and um, see what the requirements are. I know it's gonna you're gonna have to be subscribed, you're gonna have to comment on that video. And you'll have to like that video. That's probably, will probably be all the requirements. <laughs> it's not going to be too much. But if you guys would like to win a Darwin's Grip for free, <laughs> we will send it to you. But you're going to have to go over to that video. So, I hope to see you over there at that video <laughs> tomorrow. But, uh, yeah, guys, we figured we'd go ahead and end this video out here on the way to the house. Because uh, when we get there, we're going to have to drop this trailer super quick and uh, run on down there to the school. We're just going to wear what we're wearing now. And that's okay because they've seen us like that lots of times. Harley actually used to help um, coach the basketball, the basketball coach, team yeah. there. So, and uh, shout out to any of the kids if, if from any of the schools that we have <laughs> that we have ties with. You kids, if, you're, if any of y'all are watching, you know who you are because guys, we love every single one of y'all. You guys mean the world to us. You guys all have our heart and we love y'all all so, so very much. And we pray for y'all and think about y'all every day and want nothing but the best, the most happiness and success for each and every one of your lives. And if you ever need us for anything, do not hesitate. You call us. <laughs> if you know, you know, you know. I know some of you guys I know some of you guys watch our videos from the old school and from the new school. So, we love you all. And uh, we love you guys too. <laughs> all the rest of y'all. So, uh, yeah, we really love we really love y'all. We love doing these videos. And I really love <laughs> that old truck that just passed too. That was nice. Guys, we're still seeing like little remnants, made ways of the road run. <laughs> But we live in an area where we actually get to see old classic cars all the time. There's actually an old parking lot where some old timers, they pretty much meet down there like every weekend. So that's pretty awesome. And maybe we'll take you guys to that sometime. And actually, we are members of an F100 club too. So one day, if we can ever go to a meeting of that, we'll take you guys along to that. But uh, yeah, so all right. <laughs> Uh, then enough about all that. We'll talk about that another time. So guys, if you like this video, please go ahead and give it a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to our channel, please go ahead and do that too. And guys, share this video with any and everybody that you know that might enjoy this kind of content. And guys, we really, really hope you come along and do it with us next time. So until next time, see ya.